What's up everyone? I'm back with another video and today's recipe is cheese pastries. Here we have three cups of flour, quarter cup of oil, three tablespoons of powdered milk, one tablespoon of sugar, one teaspoon of yeast, one teaspoon of baking powder, some cheddar cheese and mozzarella cheese, and here we have feta cheese with olive oil and dry mint, and some warm water. In the mixing bowl, you're gonna add all of the dry ingredients. To the flour, I added a pinch of salt. Some baking powder, yeast, powdered milk, sugar, then you're gonna mix them together. Now you're gonna add the oil. You're gonna kind of mix it with your hand. Then you're gonna gradually add the water until your dough is soft. You're gonna keep doing this for 10 minutes until you get the result, which is a soft dough. This is how the dough looks like. Now, you're gonna let it rest for an hour. It has rested for an hour. It's now time to get some pieces and make bowls. Every piece, you're gonna just roll it up and it should look like this. This is how they look like. It's now time to shape them. You're gonna take a bowl. Here we have two designs. You're gonna make the bowl flat. Then you're gonna add in your cheese. You can use any type. Then you're gonna fold it in half. And using a fork, you're gonna press on it. You're gonna press hard so uh, the dough wouldn't be opened. And it looks like this. Now for design two. You're gonna get a bowl and you're gonna do the same thing. You're gonna make it flat. Then, if you have another type of cheese, which I use cheddar cheese and mozzarella cheese, you're gonna put them in the middle and you're going to also fold them in half and press on them.
then you're gonna flip them over and just press on them with your hand now using a fork or a knife just poke some holes in it and this is the second design This is how they look like. Now you're gonna cover them and let them rest for 10 minutes. Now when they rested for 10, for 10 minutes, you're gonna get some Nescafe and you're gonna brush it on top so it would get that golden brown color. For the people who don't want Nescafe, you can just use egg wash, which consists of eggs, one egg at least, some milk, and some vanilla flavor. You're gonna have a preheated oven, then you're gonna put those in the oven on 200 Celsius.